So you're thinking about moving to Nyack, New York? You've considered the proximity to New York City, but with the lifestyle of Rockland County? And you want to live in Nyack, New York? And Or are you researching about Nyack, New York and Rockland County because you're interested? I live in Rockland County for over 10 years now, and I spent a lot of good time in Nyack, especially during the summertime. And I have advised many people who were considering moving to Nyack. And in this video, I want to share with you everything you might need to know about Nyack New York. I'll be talking about real estate, things to do, places to visit, and what is Nyack known for, the amenities as well, and much more. So I hope you enjoy. Hi, my name is Betsy and I am a real estate agent in New York. My channel is all about living in Rockland County. So subscribe and stay updated. And if you're thinking about moving, make sure to reach out. So let's talk about some Nyack basics. Many people who choose to move to Nyack enjoy and love the waterfront properties, as well as its proximity to the city. Why? Because Nyack can be about 25 minutes just from New York City, as well as one of our towns that has the most similarity to living in the city, but with the lifestyle of Rockland County. Nyack is right off the Tappan Sea Bridge, renamed Mario Cuomo, and it's the first exit out of it. So there's no traffic, there's no inconvenience ever when you are going to Nyack. You also have at Nyack one of the biggest malls that we have in town is the Palisades Mall, literally just five minutes away. One of our main hospitals, which is Nyack Hospital Montefiore, is also located right off the bridge and to very quick proximity to any of the houses that are on the downtown of Nyack. Nyack is well known for its walk we have a lot of restaurants or a mainstream of businesses in the area where you can just come and enjoy by the waterfront, by the pier and have the library, the restaurants, the many amenities that you can enjoy. It has a great look. It has a very nice community, the ambience, a slow feel. If you are doing some, say like some meditation kind of ambience, it's very nice and mellow. In the summertime, we have a lot of areas where they do live music, especially jazz. If that's something that you might enjoy. They do it quite some of the activities when the time is warmer, right? When we have a much warmer Warmer weather because yes Naya tends to be a little bit colder during the winter months because it's right by the waterfront when I think about Nyack, to those who are coming example from New York City that are used to that city life, Nyack is one of the places that I can say has the most similarities to the city, more like the upper east side of New York City. It's that quietness, some building styles that we don't have many here in Rockland. In Nyack, we do. You can walk around, get to from one place, hop from one place to the other, decide where you want to be, and you are walking distance to so many places. We we also have in Nyack one of the main bus stops that goes straight to 42nd Street. We have our own line. So even at the bridge, they don't catch any kind of traffic because they just go straight. And within 45 minutes, you can be there. I know for sure that's the time it takes because I've done it plenty of times when I'm visiting the city. That's one of my to-go ways of transportation to get to the city. It's very affordable, very easy to get to and convenient. You can read or you can sleep on your way to work. Now let's talk about the amenities about living in Nyack, New York. Groceries and food. Nyack is very diverse, but is very big also on vegetarian food shop. Nyack has a lot of good restaurants and supermarkets like the Whole Foods. You have the Stop and Shop, the ShopRite, very close proximity right there and then. And also we have a Walmart that is not far. It's very well known for so many different restaurants right on one main street. One of my favorite is Cabo's Grill. It's a Greek restaurant. I am big about how they make me feel when I walk into the restaurant and Cabo gives you that home feeling style it's like they always welcome you they get to know you that's across Rockland in general but that one restaurant the owner itself makes its point to really know your name to really make sure that you are doing well we have even celebrated my son's birthdays over there and we love the food for sure we also have Dad tight kitchen which is another great restaurant it's a smaller setting they are a little slower when it comes to servicing the food but to me that's a great thing I just don't go there when I'm super hungry <laughs> it's a great thing because you get to enjoy the person that you are in common 
company at that time. You get to talk about without so many interruption from the waitress and actually you don't feel rushed. It's kind of like, take your time, enjoy your time. And it's a very nice and cozy place as well. The food is amazing. So the worth, the wait is worth. There is so many great restaurants that if I start, I will never finish. Nayakoso is very well known for many coffee shops. I go to those a lot. I do love coffee, but also because I meet a lot with my clients in Nayak coffee shops. We have a lot of mom and pops. One of my favorite is actually Adam's Chocolate. My kids love that place. It's a different experience because Nayak is about the lifestyle. It's not really even about the food. The food is delicious, but even how Having a cup of chocolate at Adam's Chocolate is an amazing experience by itself. It's, and it's very affordable. It's, it's very rewarding just sitting there, sipping on a cup of coffee all by yourself. I've done it many times before my clients get there. We also have Art Cafe. It's really the art of coffee. They make it so cute and so delicious that there is no way you cannot pay a trip to Art Cafe. There is so many in Nayak that it's just hard to mention them all. Now I have taken upon myself to literally go to each one of the businesses to know each one of them and know what I prefer, what I don't prefer. I have made it a point to really visit each one of the business and we get to enjoy and support our small local businesses as well. Nayak Ambience is very community, is very health conscious. Most of the people in the Nayak area are very organic feeling vegetarian and it's one of the places that if you want to have that type of food you can have it without question or being am amazing we have many salad bars we have nayak essentials the wild radish those are all vegetarian or vegan places that you can enjoy if that's what you prefer i am not vegan but i have to say they have so many great dishes that are amazing you don't need meat replacement just to make sure that those are delicious dishes. And it is true, that is a true statement. Right off the tap and see, you have Nayak's Hospital Montefiore. So if you're right on the downtown of Nayak, you can get to the hospital walking. Most people won't, but you can get there just walking. The parking is very simple, it's very easy. You can walk down to the riverfront from the Nayak Hospital. Let's say that you have someone having a baby, something happy happened, and you can just walk out and buy some lunch. And while you wait, you just wanna go down and walk by the Piermont and see the river, relax a little bit, maybe a new dad who knows you can enjoy it you can go and do that Nayak has so many great things to offer and once again I cannot stress enough how walkable Nayak is everything is with such close proximity from one point to the other with the libraries during summertime like I said I love Nayak during the summertime we have a lot of great events they do the Cinco de Mayo they do the sip and paint they do the cheese and pairing with the wine a lot of great events are for adults but also the kids can enjoy going to the Nayak beach we have some night lifestyle you want to go for a date night you want to go dancing with your gals or couples night we have Punta Cana Fusion it's like a lounge style it is a restaurant but they do have a dancing area but the biggest place to go dancing if you wish is Westgate they even on Thursday have salsa night they even teach salsa if you want to go and take some classes one of the greatest in activities is is Nayak Firework on 4th of July. It's an amazing show of fireworks that they do for an entire hour that you can really enjoy. There's many restaurants by the river that you can make reservation to and enjoy. You can come in earlier than the fireworks and just have dinner and enjoy yourself. And after that, you just have a beautiful full hours of amazing fireworks. Nayak is very alive. It's once again, one of the ones that I can compare the most to having more of that city-like life. It's not so greenery, but you got enough greenery, but it's more like downtown walking spaces where they do a lot of the events like live music with the jazz, soothing kind of music. And they also have Maureen's Jazz Cellar where you can have your delicious wine and enjoy the music and all of that great stuff. Nayak is all about the party. Nayak is also well known for the Edward Hopper Museum. It's a great place to visit. Many people come from outside of town just to go visit 
that museum. It's not a huge museum, but you get to enjoy and have so much more. And if you come into the museum, you can go and walk around and do so many more stuff. Around the time, also we have the many other activities that we can enjoy. For example, we do the festivals during the summertime. They also have the food market where we have a lot of naturally organic grown in the area and they come and they sell just at the farmer's market. You go in there and you know for sure that everything is naturally grown and so delicious for sure. In Nayak, we have one of the biggest boat places is Nayak Boat Charter. Over there you can go and rent any kind of boat. You are not a boat owner, you can rent one. For example, once we did a, a rental for the fireworks, you can rent it and see it from the inside of the fireworks. It's an amazing experience as well. Or you can just go and you feel like having some jet ski right with your family. Go ahead to the Nyx Charter. It's not the only one, they have several ones that you can go to. And or if you own your own boat, even better, you need a place to park it, you can do it right there and then. I know we talk about the Nyack boats and everything else, but it's because of course, Nyack is so well known for our waterfront properties and enjoying the river. My favorite part of the Nyack waterfront is the Nyack beach because they have an amazing trail. It's a five mile trail. You can walk it, you can bike it, you choose, but the greatest thing about it is that we love and we enjoy is going to the beach they have like about seven different ones right around the Hudson River and you can bring your own food have a little picnic enjoy yourself on a hot summer day or any day and that's one of the greatest one you still have is a state park so you do have some rock climbing if you just gotta be safe but it's an amazing place just to enjoy nature and to be at peace Nayak has so many great things, but if one day you don't want to be in your home and you just let me do something different or something so special like a, I don't know, a proposal, something else. We have Nayak Hotel. This is an amazing new hotel that we have that has a restaurant in it there with the igloo. It's amazing. It's beautiful. The food is delicious. You must go and enjoy it as well. Who says that you just have to go and stay for one night? You don't have to be just waiting for it. You can be a tourist in your own time. If you want to go more luxury style and you want to go more wild, Wow style, then you can visit also the Lindsford Mansion. This is a great place just to walk around. If you want to stay there for the night, it's worth the money. It's a little more on the pricey point, but it's an experience by itself. Now, to those of you who have family who care for the school district, Nyack is an amazing school district. It has portion of the Clarkstown, which is part of the new city town, but also the Nyack school. If you want more information, feel free to reach out. We can always help you depending on what side of Nyack you want to be in, you know, guide you through. And also you can just search it over there, greatschool.org, Nyack School District. Why is Nyack so well liked? Nyack is so well liked because of its proximity to the city and the waterfront property like mentioned before. It's a little bit more on the expensive side. It's, it's not expensive. I would say it's more on the luxury side because of its proximity to the city. Like I said, and I mentioned before, it's very much like the Upper East Side, but with the Rockland County advantages of living. When we talk about a little bit higher in price point, it's still very affordable because our average price point in Nyack for the smaller properties or apartments and or even smaller historic houses style is like about 650 and plus some luxury apartments yes they can go for as much as a million dollars if you wish it all depends as to what you wish to to do what you wish to have and where you want to be because of course those ones that have a backyard as part of the river where you can have your owner's access is different from just the downtown Nyack where you just have the proximity to everything but you don't have the waterfront, right? So at the end of the day, it depends on what you choose. Nyack doesn't have big tall buildings. We do have some apartments in Nyack, but based on the zoning boards and to keep our Rockland County area more urban liking and more urban living, we don't have that many apartments, but the ones that are between three to four stories tall and they are still very nice space and welcoming and walkable and all of that stuff that we all enjoy. So if you're thinking about moving to Nyack or anywhere in Rockham County, make sure to reach out. I hope this video was of great use and gave you some perspective and let us know what you think. Write something in your comments. Remember to subscribe and enjoy your day.